Okay, so I promised you guys a video when the Cardinals were around. Um, and they're around. Ah. You can see one on the fence right there, a baby. And there's another one. And another one. And another one. So there's one, two, three, four, five. There's one on the ground there. There's another one. Right there. It's almost like they know that I'm recording them. I'd love to know which one it was that landed on me. It looks kind of like that one that's on the fence right now. It was definitely an adult female. Her, her, her bill was bright orange um, and this is for my buddy David I promised him I'd get him a video of them I don't want to stand up and get a better shot of the ones on the ground I'm zoomed in right now um, But you can see the finches too. Um, that's a baby cardinal right there in the center of the screen. And that's an adult male at the top, and that's a baby on the on the feeder right now. You see his bill is still his bill is still brown, and he doesn't have any color yet. The males you can seem to tell when they fly. Um, you can see the red coming in. But when they're just standing there, they're brown. Their bills are brown. I'm going to see if I can zoom up to this male that's on the... Sorry about the unsteadiness when you zoom in. It's hard to keep. Um, and there's another one right there you can see and another one right there and another one right there two more right there and I'll zoom it back to about double there we go Yesterday was, I mean, just incredible. I was actually sitting, right now I'm about 10 feet away in the carport, but yesterday I was sitting down here on these bricks. And that's when the, the female cardinal, just it, it flew up to me and it hovered for a few seconds and then it just landed on my arm and looked at me and then flew to the feeder. And then, about less than 10 minutes later, it came around the house from behind me. And it landed right on the chair next to um, T. His wing actually hit T. And we were, like I put in that post, we were concerned that maybe, um, like, something was wrong with it, you know? But we watched her and she seemed normal. Um, there's two babies there. There's an adult. Um, there's another one on the ground over there. Um, just an unbelievable amount, especially since the babies came. Um, this spring, uh, there was maybe six of them. Seven of them around. But... You can see my feeder the way I have it set up. I need to, I need to put more seed in it later. But you can see I bought that bowl actually at the dollar store, and um, I put it there so that the squirrels can't can't crawl because they will stop at nothing to get to it. But 
so far I've been successful at keeping them away. Um, initially, I had the bird feeder back here. Um, behind the wall. And the squirrels just owned it. It was, there was nothing I could do. Um, so, and there's a lot of them around too, but there's enough seed on the ground right now where, um, where the squirrels aren't interested in, in climbing it. Um, but there you go. Um, most of them stay right up in this tree right here. There are probably 50 birds in that tree right now. Easy. Um, and, and there you go. That, that was the cardinal video that I've been promising y'all. And there must have been, oh, I don't know, 20 at least just now. So, um, we really enjoy it. And the birds are really used to us. And um, if you don't have one in your yard um, and you like birds, um, I would definitely get one, you know, and put it where you can watch it all the time because they are just incredible. Okay, everybody, that's about six and a half minutes and I'm recording it in high depth, so... Um, I'll see you guys later, and I hope everybody is doing good. Bye-bye.